Hey YouTube friends, this is your girl Lady M62 coming at you today with my Yankee Candle semi annual sale haul. Before I begin, I know it's been a minute. I have been so busy and trying to get back in order from holidays. I've had lots of family over from in and out of town, from all over the place, flying in, driving in. And I was just so tired. So anyway, I hope everyone had a wonderful, wonderful holiday. And Happy New Year to all of my YouTube friends. Okay, so let's go ahead and get into this haul. I went to Yankee Candle for their, uh, I guess this is what, January, what, December, January, fall SAS haul. I picked up a few things and first I want to show you I don't know if you can see this it's a little bit of a glare from the light this is a coupon that they gave me you get a free gift with any $15 purchase so you spend 15 you get something worth $15 so there you go and this is from January the 19th to February the 21st and that probably isn't coming through too clear as far as the dates anyway moving on to the items that I got I'm going to first show you these little votives these were 50 cents each and I believe the regular price for these are like a dollar ninety nine or something along that line but for the SAS sale they were 50 cents each so I picked up two autumn leaves and I love this. And you guys are probably going to think I'm a little bit strange, but I actually do not burn these. <laughs> like as far as light them up and burn them, I cut them and I put them into my warmer. And oh my goodness, autumn leaves, fresh, crisp, cool or cold winter day. This is like the candle you want to melt or burn. So yeah, I cut these up and I put them in my warmer. And I like doing that with the votives. So two autumn leaves and two cherries on snow. Oh my goodness, this candle right, I mean, I'm sorry, this little votive right here is so nice. And I'm sorry, I don't think that uh, Cameron wants to cooperate today I'm uh, in focus in but anyway two cherries on snow oh my goodness you guys oh wow this is so nice I've heard some raves about the actual candle but the candle in my store was not part of the SAS sale and I wasn't going to pay full price for it so I just went on ahead and got the 50 cent votive once again I'm going to cut this and put it in my warmer Oh wow, that's nice. So those were 50 cents. Then these little baby candles right here, I believe the original price for these is $10 and some change, I believe. Their original price is 10, looking at my receipt, $10.99, but they were 75% off. So I picked them up for $2.75 per jar compared to $10.99. There's no way in the world I'm paying $10.99 for one of these little candles. Sorry, not happening. Anyway, this is Red Apple Wreath. And this smells very festive. Uh, you got some cinnamon in it. Perfect for, um, for Christmas. So that's Red Apple Wreath, $2.75. And I picked up two of the gingerbread maple. And I had this in a, I think it's a one wick medium tumbler, I believe. I gotten it from the, I actually got it from the outlet. And oh wow, I love the scent. I, I, it's so nice. It smells like eggnog to me. Like a fresh, creamy vanilla, cinnamon maple all that mixed into eggnog and here you got the candle <laughs> so i love gingerbread maple all right 
let's see moving on to the larger jars I did the five for 55 and then I ended up returning a candle I returned a large jar in exchange for another one because that large jar it was a one of the pure radiance I can't remember which one but it was a white pure radiance I'm not sure if it was whisper or something along that line but anyway what happened was I burned it halfway through halfway less than halfway actually and the wood wick it started it was it moved and the fire was the flames was getting close to the glass and I was afraid that something was going to happen or explosion or a fire or something along that line and I didn't you know I didn't feel like it was no longer safe to burn it anymore but I had so much wax because like I said I hadn't even burned it halfway that there was no way I was just going to waste that candle or whatever the case may be so I returned that one and I picked up another large jar that I'm going to show you but the first five that you see is part of the five for 55 which made each candle eleven dollars a piece so let's get into them the first one is vanilla chai this one is delightful if you like the scent of just like a mm, just a vanilla with some spice in it like some mm, oh yeah this is going to be good and i don't know if the camera's uh focusing in or showing like all the oils that are in here very very nice Look at that. Isn't that beautiful? Oh my goodness. Look at all those oils. So vanilla chai. It smells very warm, inviting. Let's see. Spicy at the same time. So I'm real. I cannot wait to burn this one next. I'm currently burning blue. Uh, what is it called? Blueberry scone. And that one, I bought two. The first one that I burned a while back did not perform very well but this one you guys it is loaded with oils and I'm going to be doing a uh, a review on that one shortly so look out for that one it's going to be on blueberry stone this is not that's not a new candle it's been around for I guess a good little while I don't know but <clears throat> that one is burning like whoo the hole downstairs and it floats upstairs smells like blueberry scone but anyway let's get back to this haul so that's vanilla chai the second one is beach holiday and you know since you know summer and oh this is, smells really good mmm it just reminds you of summer and just if you think about it you've got just a few more months and it's going to be spring and before you know it summer is right around the corner so I just figured, you know, if this is an 11 buck candle, and I, I saw some good reviews about this candle too, and I watched a couple of YouTube video reviews on Beach Holiday, and it's just, it's just summer, fresh summer, it's actually in the fresh category, and I can see why, and look at, look at the, uh, the, the wax here, isn't it just beautiful, just reminds you of just summer, very nice. Let me see if I can get you get this camera to, to focus in on the all the wax. I mean the oils that's in the vanilla chai. Look at that. Isn't that nice? You guys see all of that? So vanilla chai, beach holiday. Moving on to the two wick tumblers with the soft wax. And I actually, you know, I don't have a problem with these. We'll see how these perform, but I've gotten some other two wick tumblers and I like them so this one is pumpkin butter cream and I love the way this oh wow it's just ooh, look at that it looks so good it makes you want to eat it right <laughs> this is just a very nice pumpkin good for you know Thanksgiving around that time and that's pretty much what I'm going to save this for I'm not going to burn these can this candle until the later part of this year for the holiday, Thanksgiving, etc., etc. So we've got pumpkin buttercream. There you go. And look at this one. Look at all, you can see all the marbling. I guess that's what it's called. I don't know. Or the oils. 
and this candle smells so good on cold sniff i'm hoping that it performs well when it's lit and this would be cinnamon vanilla oh my goodness you guys this is looks like this is the paraffin wax whereas the buttercream is the soft wax but this looks like it's the paraffin and oh wow you just talk about a nice soft cinnamon vanilla not too heavy on the cinnamon not too heavy on the vanilla just very warm and inviting you know i just i hope this is going to be a good one okay and next we are going to move on to pumpkin wreath i love pumpkin wreath i have quite a few of the what you call things the wax tarts or wax melts and pumpkin wreath and this is a uh, it smells really good this is the two wick tumbler and the smooth wax oh my goodness this is in the fresh category you guys oh anybody who loves this is different from pumpkin buttercream pumpkin buttercream is a lot more of a bakery pumpkin whereas pumpkin wreath it just seems like it just incorporates all of the different spices that come along with fall the pumpkin like some type of maybe sugar spice or uh, apple spice or it's just a wonderful perfect perfect fall candle and i'm looking forward to burning this one this coming year i mean uh for the thanksgiving holiday and last but certainly not least i told you earlier in the video that i had a candle that i returned as a large jar so you know they do jar yankee candle does jar for jar so what i did and this was completely free because it was an exchange for a damaged candle that i have the wick moved safety hazard i've already explained that in the beginning of the video so what i chose was strawberry lemon ice and you guys oh my gosh just two wicks smooth wax oh my god wow this just smells like a really look at this little popsicle on there that is what it smells like you take some strawberry some lemon and maybe some other type of fruit or something i don't know some lime or, or something maybe not maybe not so much lime i take that back but the strawberry and the lemon it just reminds you of a nice let's just imagine you're it's a really hot day and you get like a frozen slush drink or a uh, popsicle or something along that line and it's hot outside but this popsicle is nice and flavorful and juicy and cool it, it just gives you that nice juicy strawberry lemon scent and it just makes me mm. oh wow it just makes me want to just i don't know make some lemon strawberry lemon popsicles or something i don't know but i am looking forward to burning this one this actually was not even on the shelf the sales associate at my local yankee candle she went in the back and pulled this one out for me i think it was only in my store it was only available in a small jar so kudos to my sales associate at uh, my local yankee candle i'm going to be doing a review on this whenever i decide to burn it so anyway you guys i'm going to end this video this concludes my yankee candle semi-annual fall haul sale or however you want to word it and i am going to go i have a bath and body works haul that i'm going to be sharing with you guys so look out for that video thanks for tuning in and everyone have a wonderful day